Well, today we've got uh, an amazing mystery box and a little cat helping us. So, this is the. Stands a little bit loose. There we go. Yep. There we go. Trying a new setup, so bear with me. So, this is the amazing mystery box for June. Uh, Doctor Who Gallifreyan edition. Um, so the stamps this time are quite interesting. So we got like a little red raven head or fantastic Mr. Fox actually. It's a fox, I thought it was a wolf. And some sailboats. As you heard, there's something clunky in this, but other than that, it does feel quite light. So let's let's turn it round and I'll take one item at a time out. So, Doctor First figurine. It's a uh, Roger Hargreaves Mr. Men figure. Um, funny enough, I actually did buy one of these recently, but it's nice to have a spare one because I wanted to get one out and put it on display. Um, that's a nice figure. They did a whole set of these based on the Mr. Men books. Um, so, actually, if I'm going to open it, let's, let's take this one out. We'll have a look at it. He's quite a nice little figure. He's on a base. Uh, it's quite solid plastic. I thought they would be soft like the pop vinyls. And he's got his cane and so really moulded hair. But I suppose it depends whether you like uh, sort of mashups between Doctor Who and Mr. Man, really. Uh, I quite do. I quite like it. Ah, so this is a Eagle Moss figurine, um, which I do have a few of these, but I don't have a Dalek. So that's, the Dalek's are quite hard to get hold of, so this is the one from the Ninth Doctor Show, the Dalek. Let's take him out. And they've got loads of sellotape on it. Just grab a knife. Um, I, the only other Dalek I've got in this range is the Destiny Dalek, Suicide Dalek, and the Tenth Planet Dalek. Uh, this is a good one. Um, his ear has actually broken off, but I can glue that. So as you can see, you see that his ear is broken off, but that's a bit super glue. So I like that. Always happy for a Dalek. We put the little bit somewhere safe. Okay, take the rubbish. So next up we have we've got two battles in time card sets. Don't really collect these. I've got a drawer full of them from these boxes because they tend to put them in. So what have we got? We've got husk. Belial, oh he's from um, Death to the Daleks, Sea Devil, Vervoid, Lucosa, all seem to be classic ones, Santaran Group, uh, Super Rock, Tractator, and Exelon Antibody, that's a shiny, I think. Let's see what's in the other one. So we have Empty Child, Draconian, Zygon, Islia, Ice Lord, Mandrel Group, the wackiest monsters ever, uh, Hemivore, a dragon, Primord, and then the shiny is Kronos. You see Kronos? Basically uh, a white chicken with a bucket on its head. And that's the God of Time, would you believe? <coughs> Lots of people wouldn't. Uh, we've got a canine coaster. Yeah, always handy to coasters. I've had a few of these, not the canine one, but I've had a few of them. They're nice. Got my tea set. So this is what was clunking about. I haven't got this Doctor Who cookbook, official cookbook. 
So what sort of thing? I know they did a cookbook in the 80s and you could make things like soup and crotons. Mm. So canine. That's a nice. I wonder what food William Hartner would eat. Probably anything that wasn't foreign. Um, Sonic veggies. This is just weird stuff. Fish fingers and custard, official recipe. So, they're very glossy. Very glossy indeed. I wouldn't have normally bought that, so this is what I like about these boxes, because they fill gaps in my collection that I wouldn't normally go out and actually buy. Let's put that down somewhere without destroying everything. So it's not like that left. Oh, what's this? This item, can you get, this item is in lieu of a t-shirt, but on this occasion we've not been able to fulfill in your size. So they basically say I'm a fat bugger. Thank you for your understanding. Tam H. I wonder what it is. Or something. Oh, a Colin Baker signed print. Okay, I'd rather have that than a t-shirt any day of the week. Uh, Colin Baker, my favourite doctor. Uh, always happy to have another autograph from him. Um, yeah, that's good. I'd r much rather have that than a t-shirt, although I do like t-shirts. I've got a drawer full of them. That's, can you get that in? That's lovely. That will be something to get framed. So, all in all, um, I thought this would be a bit of a duff one with it being so light, but it's, it's actually very good. So we've got tip-top signed photo, really nice cookbook, go on the shelf, go with all my other ones. Uh, the Dalek, I love the Dalek, I love Daleks. Shame it's broken, but can repair it quite easily. The uh, coaster, meh. Doctor Who first Doctor figure. Um, again, that's good. Where'd he gone? I put him somewhere. I put him down. He disappeared. Probably fell off. Um, the collector's cards, which again, not that interesting collector's cards. So, um, yeah, a value for money box. Um, the Colin Baker one, I'd have uh, paid what I paid for the box for that. Um, so, yeah, nice one. Thanks for watching. Uh, if you want to see more of these, please like and subscribe. There's a few in the playlist at the moment, uh, going back right to the old uh, loot crates, which I used to open. Um, but thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. And also goodbye from little Maggie. Maggie, nope, she's going to sleep. What are you doing? Say hello. Say goodbye. Thanks, Ed. Bye.